and then Saratoga right in the mix there. They haven't fallen out on the outside. You can see that red boat of community. Lake Oswego, their bow popping in right here in the unique. And Bromfield Acton. Uh, looks like the only boat that may be out of it at this point. Swinging back up, Sarasota, Los Gatos, and then out in front is Deerfield. I, don't, I can't see them. Are you gonna put yeah. Deerfield rowing in what's referred to as a bucket or a German rig. You see the two rowers right next to each other on the same side in the middle of the boat. A couple reasons you can do that. We'll get into that later. Los Gatos in second place, but look at third place here. Sarasota, uh, I'm sorry, Saratoga has a little bit of a lead, but you know, ahead of ahead of Lake Oswego and community, but not much. The boats just keep getting faster and faster. We just saw the men's lightweight fours, lightweights meaning uh, for men, 160 pounds or less. For women, it's 130 pounds or less. These are the full weight. You can be as heavy as you want in the regular fours. And here's the first semifinal for the men's fours at the halfway point with a lead from Deerfield in lane four. They qualify quite fast, doing quite well now. Los Gatos in lane two, holding on to second place. Third, well, right now being held by the boat from Saratoga, but Community Rowing in lane one and Los Oswego in lane five are giving them a run for their money. Meanwhile, about a boat length back from that pack is the Bromfield Acton Boxborough boat in lane six. Right now, though, Deerfield holding on to their lead. Los Gatos. Come on, Deerfield! Saratoga trying to make a little bit of a run. Go, Togo! Go, Togo! Let's go, Deerfield! Beginning to catch up with them, beginning to pour it on as well as they approach the 1500 meter mark. It's still Deerfield in the lead, Los Gatos in second, Saratoga in third, Community Rowing in fourth, and Lake Oswego in fifth. Back in sixth place, about two boat lengths behind the pack is Bromfield Acton Boxborough. Deerfield trying to hold on at the 1500 meter mark. Now just about a five meter lead for Deerfield over Los Gatos as Los Gatos continues to move. Saratoga holding on to third, but still feeling that pressure. Who's going to sprint first? Who has the fuel left to be able to pull out that third place spot and the ability to go to the finals, the championship finals, the A finals tomorrow? We'll have to see when they come to the finish line. Deerfield in the lead right now. Los Gatos in second. It's Saratoga in third. Community rowing in fourth. And it will come down to the finish line. They received Deerfield in that bucket. Some coaches put a bucket in to equalize the forces. The bow seat does have a mechanical advantage. And the thought is if you put two rowers on the same side together, it makes the boat go straighter. Sometimes you put a bucket because you want somebody to follow somebody exactly. Very powerful rower, maybe not as skilled. You put them behind a very skilled rower, say, follow that person, and you can do that very easily in a bucket. So a couple different reasons for making a bucket. And this Deerfield boat, very nice out front. So. One. <laughs> Los Gatos now in 